Hi guys, welcome to Marzenden. My name is Valerie. Today we're gonna be talking about, I think it's Light Slacker's last release of the year. And it's so cute because it is a very cute silver trio. That's why I went, you know, the full silver moment. This is actually what the packaging looks like. I hope you can see it. I know the glare is a little intense there. It is all disco vibes, but I think Kathleen and Natalia talked about how it's like influenced by, um, like New Year's also and that they didn't want to do like the typical black and gold so I totally agree I love silver I feel like I've liked silver more than gold my whole life so I was really really excited to see this and the packaging is actually I don't know if you guys can tell but it's very glossy it's not like your typical matte packaging and this is actually the little card that comes in the packaging hold on let me lower the lights because I don't think you guys can see this all right i hope you can see it better now so if you guys want to pause to read i'm actually like super proud of my look i i don't think i've ever done like a silver eye so um let me know what you guys think every time i film these videos i miss doing makeup so 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 much so if you guys want to see any type of tutorials please let me know i would love to continue to film makeup videos for this channel okay so i'm getting ahead of myself if you're new here hi so i do swatches of every single polish in this collection i also do nail comparisons and then at the very end i do rank them from my least to my most favorite which is a uh, torture for me because i love all of the collections and the polishes and just an fyi i am doing a huge giveaway once i hit a thousand subscribers which oh my god i hit 500 the other day and i can't believe it it is so surreal i feel like it's taking me so long to hit 500 and i'm just so so grateful for you guys like thank you so much for subscribing i was like jumping up and down i was so excited and it just keeps going up so i'm like so yeah if i hit 1000 subscribers i will do a giveaway and i will obviously film a video telling you guys what the requirements and the rules are so definitely hit the notification bell as well and give this a like and yeah let's just get into the polishes okay so the very first one i have here um it was kind of a shit show because when it came in the package i noticed that the actual handle had polish like dried polish in it so i was trying so hard to delicately open it and unfortunately i broke it i'm so so sad this one is actually city of stars which is the topper and i i still have it here but um i taped it up and i'm just i'm so sad i hope it lasts a while i am gonna be taking care of it but yeah i'm a little sad about that but this one is so pretty anyways let me just read the description okay so city of stars is described as a fine holographic glitter i am obsessed with this one it is so so beautiful i love you know toppers like this this one is so cool because it's like a silvery rainbow kind of topper which to me kind of goes with any color and some other toppers are just like exclusively to like a certain you know warm tone colors or cool tone colors and i just feel like this one is stunning on every single polish okay so also this polish is named after la la land which i am so shocked to hear that kathleen said she had never seen it before because i love la la land is one of my favorite movies ever and i'm so glad it has a little representation in this collection it's so cute so obviously the first one i thought about was fuzzy socks well first of all fuzzy socks it's an actual glittery polish so it's not transparent like city of stars but i'm kind of shocked to see how much more gold fuzzy socks has which to me fuzzy socks has always been like a silver glittery polish so yeah that like really shocked me and it just made me love them both for their own individuality so i'm so so happy we have both of them okay so the next one i compared it with was here comes the sun because it is the other light slacker topper but to me here comes the sun is like a yellowy green kind of thing and that's what i meant by city of stars might be more usable with other colors with different colors that maybe won't look that good with here comes the sun so you guys can obviously tell how much more yellow green here comes the sun is and then after that i compared it to clara just because i felt like they had like that silvery bluish tone to it even though clara is obviously a non-transparent nail polish but i felt like it could be a good reference i honestly feel like city of stars would be beautiful on top of clara and then at the very end i compared it to sugar baby but just like fuzzy socks sugar baby is a just a nail polish glittery nail polish so it's not like really a topper or anything but to me sugar baby is way more like pinky peachy toned but i definitely wanted to give you guys the option to see what the difference actually is all right so the next one is actually called voulez-vous i 
I'm not really sure what it means in French, but this is the song from ABBA, which I grew up listening to ABBA, so it was so freaking cool to see the name. And it's just, it's such a pretty color. Let's just move on to the description. Okay, so Voulez-vous is described as a soft off-white with fine pink and blue shimmer. I totally understand why some of you might think it looks like Clara, but once you guys see the comparisons, you can see their actual differences. But how freaking pretty is this polish? When I was swatching it, I was like, oh my god, this is absolutely beautiful and obviously perfect for the holidays. So just in time. I think out of the three, this one was my favorite comparison because it's just, it looks so cute against all the other polishes. Obviously, the first one I compared it to was Clara. You can tell how much more blue Clara is like the actual pearlescent shimmers are straight up blue. I also said this in my post, but I almost feel like Voulez-vous has a more taupey undertone to it, even though it is still like a white pearly color. I don't know why. I just feel like it's more taupey, if that makes any sense. Maybe it's because it has pink shimmers, so it gives it a little pink kind of thing. Oh my god, it's so 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 beautiful, and I love Clara, but I don't know. Somebody asked me this too. They're like, which one do you like better? And maybe it's because it's a new you know thing i think i rather have voulez-vous but clara is just like a classic so it just all depends on how blue you want your nail polish to look okay so after that i compared it to one of your french girls i obviously thought about this like initially one of your french girls is like a nude polish with like a bluey kind of shift to it obviously they don't look alike at all but i just wanted to show you guys what the difference is all right and then after that i compared it to diamonds are forever which also gave me kind of that similarity but at the end they're super different obviously voulez-vous is so much more white and diamonds are forever are just like a nudie kind of polish which i'm still obsessed with it's such a beautiful polish okay and at the end i compared it to fuzzy socks just because it is like a silvery glittery kind of polish i just wanted to put something different out there even though they're like worlds apart but i hope this comparison helps all right and the last polish from the trio is called dirty dancing obviously from that amazing movie all i can think about is the song the time of my life which is so funny if you guys want to see my swatches and my comparisons up close you guys can go to my instagram by the way and check them out i already posted all of them okay so dirty dancing is described as a multi-toned silver shimmer with large silver glitter i was honestly shocked of how much i ended up liking this polish because like when i saw city of stars i'm like okay i love that one obviously it's such a cute silver top and then when I saw Voulez-vous, I'm like, wow, that is like Clara's sister type of thing. But then when I actually swatched Dirty Dancing, I was like, whoa, this one is so unique and so, so pretty. I actually got really excited after swatching it. Okay, so if you guys are seeing the comparisons, the first one that I compared it to is Spanglish. And I feel like the pictures and the camera don't do the colors justice because I feel like Spanglish is so much more silvery. And in my picture, I feel like it has like more of a shadowiness to it, but whatever. They do have that similarity though that silvery similarity i feel like dirty dancing is like more olivey toned of a silver which i don't think they describe it as that way but it is a little bit more olivey toned so it's amazing so beautiful with the large chunks of glitter it's just gorgeous okay the next one i compared it to is 99 angel and i compared it to this one because it has large glitters in it so it definitely gave me that vibe like it reminded me of it even though 99 angel first of all i don't even think they sell it anymore more, so i'm sorry but also it's like a pink pinky base so they're super different but they just have that large chunk of glitter similarity and then again i compared it to diamonds are forever i feel like with this comparison you can actually see how much more olivey toned it is even though diamonds and forever and dirty dancing are so so different again i wanted to give you guys a reference and of course i had to compare it to fuzzy socks at the end and again you can see how much more silvery gold fuzzy socks is they're just super different so if you guys have something similar to this don't be afraid like it is so 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 different all right so before i do the ranking i did want to show you guys another piece that launched with this trio and it is actually silver charms and i don't know if you guys know but they released gold charms recently with i think with the zodiac collection like i said i love silver so i was so excited to get these i'm gonna try to show you guys because they are kind of like transparent with the packaging and everything so i'm gonna try my best to show you guys how it looks sometimes Sometimes it does attach to the lid so I don't know if you guys can see right there it's the same thing same concept just moons and stars and just pretty things like that obviously there's like different types or larger ones or smaller ones I'm gonna lower the lights a little bit all right so hopefully you guys can see there better let me see how close I can get ah 
Oh my god. But yeah, you can see like differences right there, like a bunch of moons and stars. So, so pretty. Okay, so this ranking is super hard for me because first of all, there's only three. So there's not much to compare to other polishes. So even though it is gorgeous, stunning, beautiful, I just feel like this one I'll probably use the least out of the trio. And I'm so sorry to say this, but it has to be Voulez Vous. And I feel so sad because I really really like this polish it is so pretty like i said it's like a sister to clara and i love clara all right so my second place is to probably the most unique one i think out of the whole collection and it has to be dirty dancing i freaking loved this i was so surprised of how much i liked this polish it has like green olivey kind of tone to it with large chunks of silver so i think that is so freaking cool you won't be disappointed if you get this when you saw my swatches you could see how it actually looks in real life so i I just I love it so so much obviously my first place has to go to city of stars even though she's a little broken but that's okay I'm just obsessed because I love creme polishes but at the same time I want to spice it up sometimes so this is gonna be like my go-to for so many looks that I do even if it's like an accent nail or something like that I love it so 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 much and I love how it's like universal like I can use it for any type of tone on any color so this one has to be the winner so yeah I love it so much all right guys that is it for this video i hope you enjoyed it if you guys do use my link or my discount code i would really really appreciate it that helps out my channel so so much and i just want to thank you guys if you do please don't forget to subscribe give this a like and let me know what your ranking is or what your favorite polish from the collection is i'm always welcome to suggestions so please let me know if you want to see anything from me i do have a couple of videos coming up that are non um like beauty related so be on the lookout for that if you want to watch more of like a different side of me but yeah i love you guys so 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 much thank you guys for the 500 i'm beyond excited and thankful for you guys so really really appreciate that and i will see you guys on the next one